Hey yo, welcome back to another episode of Zanse 5. My name is Mukutem Lambo. And in the spirit of collaboration, something that we love and something that we love doing today, the very special episode where we bring back my top five list. I don't know if this is going to be five, but I just want to shine the light on the top and probably my favorite uh, producer artist combinations. Are you ready? All right, let's get straight into it. Right, first of all, my favorite one. Uh, one of my favorite ones. Oh, all of these are my favorites. Sokomatimai and Pro G. Now, I can't stress how much chemistry these two guys have. In fact, it almost feels like anything that Pro G puts out has to be with uh, <laughs> Sokomatimai. They gave us the three way ET, they gave us Neria, they gave us King, amongst many other bangers. Something that you always love to see and live. They really, really uh, complement each other styles and that's always something that i love to see man another combination that i like is k breezy and panas now with an album coming up coming coming next an album coming yes they have an album coming uh, it's called when we're not being lazy and we're still waiting for that one but aside from that these guys have uh, worked together on numerous 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 songs together i think uh, panas was also on a uh, me summer uh it was on rubies and diamonds as well uh, on high gabi as well so it's incredible chemistry that they have and probably one of the top producers uh, coming out from the city of kings Another one is uh, Tuck Money and uh, Take 5. Now, this one also a little bit tricky because, you know, uh, you could also say Take 5 and Junior Brown, but I, I feel like Take 5 understands Tuck Money's voice very well and he always manages to give him the best beat, the best beats that match that husky, you know, greedy voice and that tone. Uh, so, you know, when they dropped the collabo album, Gwanda rules you could feel that you could feel that and um take five's produ production was also um on uh takmani sophomore album uh skirir and firim and uh, you should go check that out it's not available on you know normal platforms because takmani treats his music like he treats weed uh you never know uh you never find it in the open but if you want it you you will find <laughs> you find it uh, another collaboration uh, between artist and producer that i like indigo saint and uh portland portland get on these niggas man yeah man portland is incredible one of Laura's top producers as well and he managed to give us a collab album um with area 51 but also with indigo saint and that's what i want to highlight because i think they made incredible music together and also uh one of one of my favorite uh indigo saying songs which i'm just gonna put right here right here right here yeah. <laughs> yeah, which was an ode uh to calvin his song uh scoopan so portland indigo saint really hoping to that we can get more music because i really think these guys are amazing another collaboration that i love mile and vestless this is also one of those where i feel like mile just as one producer <laughs> when you hear that he sign up you just know you just know you're about to get a mile uh, song you know like they got two projects uh, together one of them uh, this two shall pass which had the majority of it uh, the production uh, done by vestless and they do not miss they just it just feels like you're listening to two best friends uh making music and shout out to mile and vestless and then we have the hardest working underground artist in Zimbabwe, Malcolm Mufunde and Yad Universe. Oh my days, man. Yeah, so it's actually uh, Malcolm Mufunde and the maker uh, under the Yad Universe network. But yeah, just gonna, I think these guys have like 17 albums together, you know, Ekaya, Economy, and now another one coming this Valentine's uh endly. and yeah man until 2077 we're still gonna get another album <laughs> from this two that much i believe i don't know uh, what this one is gonna, is gonna be called maybe a boy sky or something like that who knows who knows so yeah malcolm malcolm definitely malcolm and the other universe definitely putting in the work and then arguably my favorite and this one is probably what inspired uh this list is asaph and charlie zimbo now i don't know why asaph is not uh, making music with charlie zimbo man because these two made magic they gave us two classics kings villa one and two um i think charlie zimbo is also on uh Berg boys i think if i'm not mistaken um you know the, the chemistry is just unparalleled like 
Charlie Zimbo just brings out the best of ASAP, okay? And I'm not talking bangers or anything like that. I'm just talking like music where you're just like, damn, I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this. the stories, the lingo, everything, the production. It just makes it sound so, yeah, timeless. You know, it gives it incredible uh, shape, shop life. And that's it. That's it. That's it for me. It's a quick one. As always, trying to keep it short so that we can keep it moving. I've been Mukut Zim Lambo. This is Disaster 5. Shoot! Catch you on the next one.